all right guys what is up and i'm bringing you guys oh my god another black ops video on firing range what is it with me in this map for some reason i've always seen to get gameplays on this map in black ops and yes i am using 74u but it's only because there was a contract for it so uh chill out bruh so let's get into the topic of the day now i'm assuming the name of this video is going to be about it's all who you know or something along those lines now you might not understand what the title of the video kind of means or represents. Now, to get somewhere in a Call of Duty community now, if you're someone as small as me, channel-wise, subscriber-wise, view-wise, uh, it's gonna pretty much take a miracle for me to get anywhere big, or a lot of uh, a lot of hard work and a lot of time put in. Now, a lot of time I could put hours upon hours into my videos and never make it anywhere. But I don't mean hours into each video, I mean time in general. I, uh, if I kept doing this and this market of Call of Duty commentating was still a big factor and people still really liked, uh, loved to watch it and stuff, uh, of course over time I'll get big. That's just because I've been here for so long and I'll have like the seniority and you know over time people will start to get, uh, to, get to know me and you know obviously the, the longer I'm here. It, like the more famous here you're gonna get. Now I don't think famous is really a proper word. I don't really enjoy using that, but I, I guess you could say more popular. Of course, that's how it works. It's just because over time, people are bound to stumble upon one of your videos. But I'm never gonna get big like some YouTubers, and the reason for that is that it's kind of all about who you know. Uh, I was talking to somebody from Machinima, Machinima partner. And uh, his name is David. And um, anyways, he was saying that like, you know, the reason that half the people in the Call of Duty community are where they are today is because they knew somebody that was big at one time, or they got a shout out. And now I personally don't want to get big off a shout out. And a lot of people ask for me to submit gameplays into like the Mark J Wings of Redemption, which you know, actually I've I've submitted gameplays into Wings of Redemption's channel, and uh, I've done that before, but. I don't really want to get a shout out to help kickstart my channel. I want to be able to say that, you know what, I kind of did it myself. I started from nothing, and I remember when I first started my channel, a lot of people didn't like me because, uh, th not this time last year, but about uh, two years ago, pretty much, uh, I, I wasn't even posting Call of Duty videos. It was just uh, like uh, in life videos, and I they're all down by now, but I was really immature and my voice was really, uh, I guess you could say, squeaky. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know, of course, you know, you're gonna get hate, look at advanced UAV, but maybe in time when, uh, you know, he gets a bit older, it'll change for him, but without getting off topic, like I was saying, it seems that the only way to succeed in this community right now, unless you really stand out, which is hard to do because most things that people have already done in this community is to get a shout out or to be known by somebody that, you know, will pretty much help you guide your way through there and uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be difficult but you know what at the same time I'm not too worried about it because even if this community died tomorrow even if you know let's just say 90% of the people that watch Call of Duty videos stopped watching and there was only a really small portion left like 5-10% I'd still be making videos even if you know people I, I only had one two views of video because this wasn't popular. This wasn't the in thing anymore. Say, say three years from now, Call of Duty is no longer popular, and I'm still playing Call of Duty. Chances are I'm gonna upload it because you know I'm not here, you know, to for for you know everyone to watch my video. I'm here because I enjoy it. I'm not here to try and get famous, to try and get popular, you know. And I'm just here because this is a hobby and I enjoy doing what I do because, you know, it's, well, I always found it kind of fun and I kind of, you know, looked up to the other Call of Duty commentators when I was younger and, you know, still today, I think it's really cool that I'm able to make a video and talk over it and people will actually enjoy listening it and, you know, people will like my video, people will favorite my videos, people will comment on my videos leaving good feedback and telling me good job, Chris, and you're a beast and all this stuff and it really means a lot. So, I just couldn't want to share that with you guys, and, and thank you guys for everything. I really do mean it. Hope you guys enjoyed.